Hello everybody. I hope everybody is well. I just wanted to share with you a few flowers I've been making this weekend. Weekends I don't usually get a lot of time to do things, um, so smaller projects are much easier for me. The first things I did was make quite a few of these little um, paper flowers. And they're just book paper and just, just any kind of button you want. I've sewn the thread through the buttons and then glued the button to the book paper. You can do them in any colour you like. Uh, very simple, been around for a long, long, long time. I, um, I saw a picture on print Pinterest and I thought I'm going to make some of those. So I'll put a link to that picture that I saw in the description box below. Uh, great for in your journals, great for on cards and things like that. So um, that's one simple flower I've been making and the next one was a tutorial I saw by Roseanne this morning and I thought "Ooh, I'll make that because I've been playing with my scraps and it was her snippet flowers um, I think she made them a bit bigger than I have but I like small flowers so that's the first one I made and I will put a link to her tutorial as well in the description box because like I said they're very very simple to make and they do look ever so pretty and that's the second one and under that I've just put a lace gathered flower and I like the way that looks I think it just it finishes it off and it looks like a flower doesn't it so there's some more that I've been making and <laughs> believe it or not my scrapbox is getting low so I have to make some more scraps before I can make some more scrap flowers and things um, I've also, over the last couple of weekends or so, I've been making these flowers. Uh, I, these are done in velvet and I've made single, uh, single flowers and double flowers. I'll just take a small selection out. They're the double ones and they're done in velvet and aren't they beautiful? And these are just the yo-yo flowers. Yo-yo flowers have been around for such a long time. Um, I used to make them when I was quilting before I even knew about crafting on YouTube so they're a, and gosh they've been around forever um, but how pretty are they just you know so pretty just using little appliques in the middle and I think that's a little applique from Irene's store and a center it's seriously scrapping but how lovely that's um just off cut of lace and just various centers and how pretty do they turn out and they really don't take a lot of time You're just cutting a circle gathering it up and putting a center in very very easy so that's the fun I've been having this weekend and thoroughly enjoyed it and if you want to know how to make a yo-yo flower um, just put in the search box above on YouTube yo-yo flowers oh, oh it's a pin <laughs> um, yo-yo flowers and you'll get dozens of tutorials coming up showing you how to make those um, as well as gathered flowers simple gathered flowers dozens and dozens of tutorials showing you how to make those as well so I hope you like what I've made thank you for joining me today and I hope you're all having a lovely lovely weekend bye bye